So what is AP Automation? What does it do? AP Automation auto-creates BizTrack supplier invoices from incoming PDFs and can auto-approve those invoices if they match. The primary purpose, this can result in big time savings for the AP department. So how does AP Automation accomplish this? AP Automation uses OCR, Optical Character Recognition. This is a term used to describe software that can convert printed characters into digital text. AP Automation uses this technology to read the incoming invoices so it can pass the information along to BizTrack to create supplier invoices. Cool, right? Our partners at Innovate have been busy though. They've made AP Automation even more powerful by adding in another tech industry buzzword, AI. Ooh. With AP Automation's new AI template, it's easier than ever to get started. Their AI template will automatically interpret the fields on an incoming document with about 93% accuracy. For the remaining 7%, where the artificial intelligence doesn't get it right, you or someone you know can use your own real intelligence to quickly and easily correct it. The best part, this makes the AI smarter too. Everything sounds good in PowerPoint, so let's open the software and actually take a look. With BizTrack up, you can see I've selected uh, four POs. We're going to take these POs and we're going to invoice them using AP Automation. You can see right now that they are in the status of waiting for invoicing. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to pull up my AP Automation program. And I, I could choose to browse for files like uh, from a specific folder from here, or I can just drag and drop. I'm going to go ahead and drag and drop a couple files. So here I can see that it's read all of the information off of the incoming file, and it's giving me a little preview of, of where it's putting all that information in order to send it on to BizTrack. As long as that's all right, I'm just gonna hit next. I can see that it's also done that for the supplier invoice from National. And so, uh, you know, I can kind of review all those if I want to, or, uh, or I can just choose to uh, hit save all. And that's going to bring those uh, supplier invoices into BizTrack. So now back to BizTrack, I can see that those two uh, purchase orders have been invoiced. And if I right click and go to related documents for one of those, I can see that a supplier invoice has been created. Um, so that's in the, the related documents tree. And uh, it actually also moves a copy of the PDF that was imported into the related documents folder as well. All right, with that, let's go ahead and process the remaining two invoices. So I'm gonna bring this one in first. Uh, so I can see on this one that um, I don't have a supplier code. So there's no way for the program to know uh, exactly what supplier this is for. It seems to be reading everything else properly. So I'm going to provide that supplier code to it and go ahead and bring that into BizTrack as well. All right, now we can see a feature of the way the program works in that when I grab another incoming supplier invoice from Orgle, this time it remembers the supplier code. So it's actually looking at the addresses and it understands that, okay, this is the same one from before. Um, and it's basically learned that um, this address means uh, the supplier code based on the previous invoice that I put in where I had to manually override it. So that's an example of the program learning kind of as you correct small things and becoming better over time. So I'll go ahead and save that. And we're done. So now back in BizTrack, I can see that all of my purchase orders have been successfully invoiced. AP Automation is an enormous value add due to the time savings to AP. Thank you for watching this introduction to AP Automation presentation. Have a great day.